So it was a day after Michael Cohen received his three-year prison sentence, which he says was the worst day of his life. And, and then those attacks from President Trump started early yesterday morning, continued throughout the day. At some point, Cohen, who wasn't planning to speak out, felt he had to respond. Now, there are some things he can't answer because he's still cooperating with prosecutors, but he directly contradicts President Trump's claims about those hush money payments to porn star Stormy Daniels and playmate Karen McDougal. And as you'll see, he is emotional, remorseful, and determined to tell what he says is the truth about President Trump. The president's tweeting from very early uh, in the morning. Uh, several different things. What struck me most is his claim that um, you, you agreed to this plea deal for this reason, he said. Those charges were just agreed to him by him in order to embarrass the president and get a much reduced prison sentence. I didn't always lie. No, I, I used to tell the truth. But then one day I, I told a lie and I got away with it. And basically he says, his claim, uh, you're lying. Yeah, told my parents I had a brother that they'd never met. You lie for him for a long time. Yeah, that's what happened. So what do you say to people, and you know, there are a lot of people who would be watching who are gonna be thinking, but wait a second, he lied for so long, why should we believe him now? What's the answer? So if you're out there listening, and you wanna stop your habit of lying, just give us a call. Because we have meetings now every week at, at my house in Jamaica.